with Kelly. We're gonna make a card and I'm feeling kind of springy. Flowers and pink and yellow and blue and all those fun colors. So let's point it down here and make a card. We're gonna make a six by six card. Here is a sample. Bit so you can see, it stands like this. Now I didn't decorate it, like I didn't put sentiment or anything on it because that way I can use it for whatever I need to at the time that I need a card. There's space on the back for you to write. So let's see here. Looking down here more. You need one piece of 12 by 6. I'm going to score at 3 and 9. And then we're going to fold. Keeping it folded like that, if you lay this down, you're going to make just a little dot, pencil mark, or with your tool, at three quarters and five and a quarter. And you're going to do that on both sides. Three quarters and five and a quarter. Okay. And then you're going to sorry, got all my pieces here. That little mark that you made at the three quarter, you're going to score that from that score mark that you've got there down to this score mark, this score mark down to this score mark. Then let's turn it back like this and you're going to score at the six inch mark but only down to that first score line. Turn your card the other way, and again at the six inch, but only to that first score line. Then, if you go on your scoreboard, you can also use a ruler to do this, but that score line that you made from the first score line on both ends, you're actually going to cut that score line down both. I'm going to cut those two. Now, fold these two. This is a tool I should be using. Okay. And then your marks right here at the six inch. Make mountains. <laughs> I forgot some score marks. 
I was looking at this thinking, why does this look so different? <laughs> I'm gonna put this back in here. I was wondering why it looked so different. And we are going to score at four and eight, but only in this middle section. Four and eight. I knew there was something I was missing. And these are going to be melting folds as well. your main card blank. Now all your pieces you need this one. This one. You need four pieces of two and three quarters by five and three quarters. So I got five weight or four weight of that. And then you need four pieces that are two and a half by five and a half. And I have chosen two different patterns. You need one three and three quarters by four and a half and one four. Uh, what am I doing here? This one should be, yep, uh, five and a quarter, yep, by three and a half. Right, like that. Then, Two pieces of four and a quarter by three quarters. And that's those two. And then four pieces of Two and three quarters by half. Two pieces of four by half. And then four pieces of two and a half by a quarter. Let's get this all glued together.
All right, let's get this all glued on together now. So these strips will go here. These four little strips here. One of my bloopers. <laughs> I'm a little off on this matte layer, so I'm just gonna trim it before it gets too glued down. literally just slivers off.
off of an event. So I'm not going to put a sentiment or anything on it until I'm ready to use it. There you have a six by six pop-up gate fold. Thanks for watching. We'll see you on the next video. Bye-bye. Yesterday